Hi, my name is Alex and this is part 5 of our WordPress mini-series. In this short and quick video, we are going to show you how to put a photo gallery into your blog, or whatever website it may be. Galleries are awesome for so many reasons. You can show off all your cool pictures, or just show off your website. To start, we have to, as always, go to the dashboard. First we'll create the page that our gallery will go on. So let's click Pages, Add New, and call it Party Pictures. We'll add an exclamation mark to make it even more exciting. Now click Publish. Now we have an empty page ready for our gallery. Let's go to the Plugins section. Plugins are cool because they're pre-coded tools which you can add to your WordPress page. To add a new plugin, you've got to click Add New and then we'll search for the plugin that we want to use. We want a photo gallery plugin, so we'll just search the term gallery. So you'll find a few. We'll scroll down and pick the first one called gallery. And then click install now. It will ask you to confirm. Just say OK when prompted again, and it will install. We have it installed now, but we still have to turn it on. To do this, we just click activate right here and the page will refresh. Next, if you look on the side, you will see that there is a new section called Galleries. Click on it. Okay, now we're in the Galleries section. Before we get excited and start uploading all our pics that we want to show off, we need to first create a gallery to put them all in. It's always better to be organized than to just throw pictures everywhere. Click Add. And then let's name it Marble Comics Grand Opening Party. Sweet. Click Publish. And there we have it, we've got ourselves a new gallery. Now we have to upload our pictures to this gallery. Click on Upload a File, and here you can browse your computer for the pics that you want to add to your beautiful gallery. Select the ones you want to upload, and then hit Open. And voila, they're all in there. That simple, isn't it? Just so you know, these pictures can be removed at any time, so it's not permanent. You can add more pictures too if you'd like. Okay, once we've done that, just hit update and we've officially named all the pictures. Also, we can arrange the order of the pics. All we have to do is drag and drop the pics in the order that you want them to appear. Easy peasy. Okay, so once we have the order, we just click update and there we go. Perfect. The next step is to drop our gallery onto our page. This is pretty easy too. Everything here is. Go back to the top of the page and look on the right hand side under Gallery Shortcode. Select this little script here, right click and copy it. This script is called a shortcode and it lets us add a whole bunch of really complex code to our pages without having to do any of the work ourselves. Let's go back to our Party Pictures page. Here all we have to do is right click and paste the shortcode. You can also use the keyboard shortcut Control V. That's it. Now we're done with those updates. Let's go ahead and click on the Update button. Flip over to your other browser tab and hit Refresh. And would you just look at that? It worked, as usual. But see how these pictures are staggered, like this? I don't like it one bit. So let's go back to your dashboard. Click Plugins. Click Settings on Gallery. And then see where here where it says count images in a row? We're going to change that to two. And click on save changes. Now let's take a look and see the change on the page. There we go. Much better. You'll notice there's a comment section here. Now even though comments are nice and we like to hear what people are saying, we don't want the comment section here. We're just in one of those moods today. So what we've got to do is go back to the dashboard, then go to Pages, and Quick Edit. Deselect the comment box, and that should do it. And simply click Update. Let's go have a look and see what happened. It worked! Snazzy! Now we can easily do this over and over again by adding more galleries with more pics. So see here, the gallery is all nice and pretty. Let's see what happens when we click a picture. So beautiful. And we just scroll through with these little arrow buttons here. How easy was that? We rule, don't we? 
That's it for this video. In our exciting grand finale, we'll be covering how to embed documents into your website.